Yeah, he only reached double figures three and times it. last year. And a good pass inside and a good reverse by Scooter Gillette. Picked him right there. Numbers if they hurry. White, no look from Woodbury for the two-handed step Basami. Good start for Scooter Gillette inside the first. A3 from number three, Peter Jock. This is the third different Iowa player that has drawn the assignment on Sanders. We saw Gazelle start the game on White. Good defense again by Iowa. White will push ahead to Woodbury. Big man run on the floor. Gets yeah. the bucket. Jock will start the break. The bounce to White. Filling nicely, and he gets the two. Beautifully run fast break by the Hawkeyes. The last three or four times down the floor. Gazelle over to McCabe for three. The shooting pocket of McCabe, all he had to do was catch and release. Sanders on the dish to Jones, and Jones with the answer for three. Extra pass, Utah focus. Sanders with one second. Sanders shot, will not roll home. Sanders frustrated as he goes to the locker room, and a 47 26 advantage for Iowa. We'll start things off in the second half on the drive to the basket. Tip jam by Basabi. What a way to start the second half. He hasn't necessarily converted a lot of things at the rim, but he has shown a great deal of fearlessness in terms of getting right there. He's just hoping that he gets bailed out with a foul call. Marble wide open for three, and Devin Marble will hit that shot every time. Oh, Done a nice beautiful. job. Well, Jock getting to the inside position, and Ola Shaney follows it up. Clemens might have got away with a little <laughs> shove there. Clemens with the ball fake, and that has it ripped out of his hands by Xavier Harris. Long pass ahead to Sanders, and Sanders with one of his few uncontested looks of the night. It's a credit to both the group of returners and Jock as Nix rains it down from three. Gazell, oh good pass God. inside to Ola Shaney. Another opportunity, but taken away. Jock. One on one against Nix. Runs it up and in. An impressive performance tonight for Fran McCaffrey's squad. 